Hi, this is Alex here. So today I'm going to cover the decimal point in Q&E software in sales purchase and also the template. So by default, the system set as a round number for quantity. So for example, if my traveling charges is by kilometer and I want to change it to kilometer, let's say 25.6. But I'm unable to click decimal point here. So the first thing we need to do is to change the setting to allow decimal point. So we need to go to maintenance, system options. So here there are three places that we need to change. First is the sales. We can see here quantity precision. So this one, change it to two decimal point. Same thing, go to purchase, change it to two decimal point, and then go to stop. So here, quantity precision, change it to two decimal point. Okay, you can have more, but standard last two decimal point. So once you change it, save, close. So you might need to exit this to refresh the database. Okay, let me close everything. So now I go back to quotation. New. Okay, just choose one customer. So now you can see the decimal point here. Let's say now I want to charge 25.6. Okay, this is a new unit kilometer. Okay, one kilometer is This is my rate, so I save first. Same thing goes to the template, and the template also many templates default is without decimal point, but the pricing normally is with decimal point. So I will show you after this how we want to change it to the template. So let's have a preview first. The standard template for quotation, you can see here the quantity do not have decimal point is automatically rounded so now we need to change the template so in this quotation here go to task design so choose the template that you are using so in this case I just choose this SL01 as an example click amend okay you can give this new template a name So a design uh, template will sh show up for you to design the template. Okay, now the system have generated another template, another name under quotation decimal. So now, we need to change the formatting here to decimal. The easiest way is, because in amount, you can click here, preview. Okay, the easiest way I want to show you here the quantity the formatting do not have decimal but actually the unit price and amount do have the decimal point so the easiest way to change the design here 
is I will copy the formatting from unit price or amount into this quantity so if you see this quantity here you click on the quantity and then you click this small arrow here on top top right you will see this formatting this formatting is very similar to the excel formatting it means that no decimal point so if you go to this unit price and then click this small arrow on top right you can see this formatting with the decimal point so the easiest way is you can just copy here then you click outside go to quantity here highlight the format string Control v to paste just now I click Control c to copy then save so you can preview your changes okay now you can see the quantity is with the decimal point okay thanks for watching